paid newsletters are all about monetizing and going deeper with the fan base. And the paid newsletter by itself is often really bad for expanding the fan base because things are behind a paywall. So creators have to be very, very intentional about that. So I think paid products for the most part are going to go deeper with the existing fan base. A lot of newsletters are going to do that because newsletters don't have a discovery engine. Whereas something like a book, a song, all of that can be a lot better for expanding the fan base. For example, if I'm trying today to go on, pick a TV show, Good Morning America, something like that. I want to go on there. They're going to be like, tech founder has a newsletter and a pot. Like, no. But if it's like, oh, new book coming out, James Clear, whoever, right? It's now in a format that they understand. And they're like, oh, we have authors on our show. We don't have newsletter creators on, but at some point we will. The book puts it into a format that they expect and understand. And so then they're like, oh, great. He slots into the predefined thing. So I think it's about knowing if something is for connecting deeper with the audience or expanding the audience. And then how can you package your material in a way that whatever your group you're trying to break into expects it in that format.